सब कॉस्टल व्यूज आर अगेन टू शॉर्ट एक्सेस एंड लॉन्ग एक्सेस सो जस्ट ब्लो द जीफिस्टर्नम पॉइंटर पॉइंटिंग एट थ्री ओ क्लॉक इट विल बी शॉर्ट एक्सेस सो इट विल बी मेजरली वी विल बी सींग एट्रिया इन दैट ओके एंड डू द एस वी सी डॉपलर्स बिकॉज इन दिस इफ वी स्वीप विल स्वीप अपवर्ड्स वी विल सी एस वी सी एंट्रिंग इन टू एल ए एंड दैन वी हैव लॉन्ग एक्सेस दैट द पॉइंटर इज पॉइंटिंग एट ट्वेल्व ओ क्लॉक पोजिशन हेयर वी विल बी सींग मेनली द आई वी सी एंड द अबडोमल आयोटा सो नाउ यू सी हेयर इज माई प्रोप पॉइंटर इज पॉइंटिंग एट थ्री ओ क्लॉक पोजिशन जस्ट ब्लू द जीफिस्टर्नम again you will notice what we have done is we have brought this probe orientation marker down just because this kind of orientation the ra ra is nearer to my probe so this is my ra la interatrial septum this is the flap you are seeing so this is the pfo and these are the two pulmonary veins entering in my la and this is your tricuspid valve so this i am doing the color dopplers to look for flow in the interatrial septum now you will not see any flow through this interatrial septum even though there was a flap i i noticed pfo why you see this range this range is high this basically is a range for arterial flow system so if i decrease this range i will be start i will start seeing the color flow through the pfo because this is a low velocity system and this red jet you are seeing entry into ra is your svc superior vena cava flow and then now the pointer is pointing at 12 o'clock position in if i 12 o'clock position instead of 3 it is now facing 12 o'clock it is swept towards the right side what i would see i would see ivc this is my ivc through the liver entering into ra the characteristic feature it fans out and this is your hepatic vein which is joining your ivc and keeping the pointer up there if i sweep towards the left side what i would see i would see this engorge pulsating vessel just below we will see a spine this engorge pulsating vessel and there are two branches celiac and sma sma and celiac going out of this trunk so this is your abdominal aorta